Guess who's back? We are back. We are back again for question and answer four. Number four. Oh. Number four. Nice. <laughs> Chess Peru is back. Yeah, Chess Peru. Yes. Did you miss us while we were gone, or did you not miss us while we were gone? I think you missed us while we were gone. Yeah, no, that's a stupid question. Let's get down to business. Yeah, let's get down to business. Hey, let's see if we remember how to even do this. Okay. We have questions from what is McKenna. Question number one. Okay, so question one. If you could make one sound for the rest of your life, what would it be? It, it would be like... <laughs> yeah, probably like that. Yes. Because that's what Chess Proof sounds like every day yes. anyways. We, we would love to make sound like that, because we already do. Question number two says... Number two. Number dos. It says, soaps come in different colors, so why is all lather white? Soap. Oh, so for like in the shower? It's, it has something to do with the water. And the cream. Yes, you rub soap and it makes the cream, and all cream is white. Duh. It's called lather. Why do you think they call like, it lather? Because it's brown? Yes, like sour cream. Yes. Not sour cream. Yes. Sweet cream. Ice cream. It's all about the cream. There's nothing mm. called like red cream. Or I've blue. never had red cream. Yeah. All I've had is white. Yeah. Number three. Number three, yeah. Let's see if you can find the question we don't already know. Yeah. Ten things about before you were even born. Yeah, we're gonna answer ten things about this before you can say one thing. We don't even know two things about it. Just yeah. ten. Why is it not funny to hit funny bone? Who says it's not funny? It is so funny. Check this yes. out. <laughs> <laughs> this is like funny, bro. Oh my goodness. If Chess Peru says it's funny, it's funny, yes? It's funny, yes. <laughs> Holy crap, just drop a notebook. Oh my gosh. Good job, she, McKenna. McKenna thinks she can just ask us as many questions. Yeah, she, she thinks she's like a fireman yeah. or something. So, question number four. She asks, when is up? And what is down? That's a good question, McKenna. Pretty much all the time is up, because Ch Chess Proof never will let you down. Yeah, it will never go down. We'll just keep getting up and up and up. Till, yes. we're, till we're into space with Space Tiger. Yeah, like outer space is where, like, that's as far up as you can ever go. We might even go out of space, because we're up higher. Oh, man. What do they even call that place? I guess we'll find out when we get there. Wait, Kush is trying to hold <laughs> one in right now. <laughs> so we got a question from our good friend. Oh, Wani! It's Wani! It's Wani! Wani! She asked a silly question called, What do you call male ladybug? Who knows? <laughs> I never even got a ladybug in the mail. No. <laughs> I never even got a ladybug in the mail. No, either have I. It probably costs like $10 to even ship a ladybug without getting the squish. <laughs> I wouldn't even want to call it. I wouldn't want to call a ladybug. It's a waste of time for us, do you? Brittany? Nicole? Our friends filled by prospects? What yes. the heck? <laughs> it's been a while. So our first question is, it's a really good one. It's pretty good. It says, if Turtle loses his shell, is it naked or is it homeless? <laughs> turtle loses his shell. It's not even turtle. No, it's like it's like a goat. <laughs> it's like bald cat. Yeah, it's not turtle. It's not homeless. It's just not turtle. Yeah, it doesn't have a shell. So that's like asking, what is what is walnut without shell? It's called a peanut. Yeah. We got another like question it. from our friend, filled by prospects. Yes. This one says, why are there flotation devices in airplanes instead of parachutes? Because that's just the way things are these days. Because if you go over the water, you're pretty much screwed anyway. <laughs> yeah, and it's like, why would you even need an airplane unless you're going over water? I mean, don't you have a car? Yeah, you can drive. Yeah, so it's like, oh, you have a parachute in your car? Yeah, do you have a parachute in your car? Then just why in case you crash? Yeah, or I'm gonna go off a cliff. No, I'm gonna push it out front and get him get to the back. Oh, you're dead meat, pal. Yes. 
they ask us another question because they think they can ask lots. Yeah, so, think. anyways, they ask us, at the movie theater, which armrest is yours? That's a pretty easy question. Which one do you always use? The middle one? Yeah, duh, the one in yeah, the middle. Duh. It's like you're sitting in the movie, are you thinking about where your arms are? No, you're watching a movie. Yeah, nobody's thinking about my arms. Yeah, they don't even know whose arms are touching them. Yeah. So, like when I'm sitting at home, I can put both arms on both sides of the chair. So why would I worry about it when I'm doing something that takes my mind off of my arms? Yeah. And it's like, you're spending money, put your arms in everywhere you want to put your arms. Yeah. Like anybody cares. Yeah. I paid $10 to watch a movie. What are we talking about here? Feel that prospects. They ask us one more because they think we have all day. Yeah, they think we know answer to every question and yeah. just have all the time in the world. Yeah. Anyways, they, they ask us, what do you know when you see an <laughs> What do you do when you see an endangered animal eating an endangered plant? If you're around chess fruit, you're always in danger. Yeah, because we're in danger and people want to kill us. Yes. It's like. You see an endangered animal eating an endangered plant, who cares, they're both going to be dead soon anyway. Yeah, because they're endangered. Or King Phoenix. Look who decided to show. Oh, we got one from our old friend Knipstra. Yeah. What are you doing? I haven't seen you in like a year. Yeah, you think you're all cool, you don't have to talk to us no more? Yeah, you can just ask us questions, we don't have to talk to you face to face. Just through the interweb. Yeah, that'll be the day. Yeah. They're asking us, what does the word lisp have an S in it? Because if they took out the S, it would be lip. And if they put it on the end of the word, it would be lips. Yeah. Why does the word lips have an S in it? Because there's two of them. Yeah. That's why lisp has an S in it. Because there's two of them. Okay. It is Spazzy Kanga 91. Oh, your friend Jasmine. Yes. What's up, girl? Mm -hmm. She asked us, if there's no such thing as stupid questions, what do stupid people ask? I can only think of one thing. Yeah, smart questions. Yeah, and anyways, Chesprew doesn't ask stupid questions, they only answer them. Yeah, and we only ask smart questions to stupid people. Yeah, and only stupid people could ever answer them. Yeah. Oh, we got another one from Spazzy Kanga. Actually, this one might be from her mom. It says, how many hats are in the official Chesprew hat collection? How many hats are in your collection? Yeah, I think they can just go into our closets and dig through our stuff. Yeah, do you think we're going to go in there and count one, two, three, how many we have? Yeah, Jeez. we're not going to have any time to answer your questions if we have to count all the hats in the world. Yeah, do you need us to go count them? Oh, Dylan Kratz is oh, in the house. Kratz in the cable. Dylan Kratz! Oh man. He asked us, when will Chess Peru be playing a show in my hometown? Hometown? Where's that? I don't even know. Oh, Hometown Buffet. We love that place. Oh, yes. They have I the like... best ham dinner. Oh, boy. Oh, ham dinner. Oh, everybody loves ham dinner. I will play a show there for free ham dinner any night of the week. Yeah, just give us free ham dinner and we'll be there every day. Yeah, which one do you want to meet us at? Just give us the address. We'll be yeah. there. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. We got a question from Big Wes Sanderson. Big Wes. Big Wes. What did he say? He asked us a good question here. What is Cougar Call? Who cares? Yeah. Think I got all day to call Cougars if I'm busy working on answering your questions? Yeah. Sometimes you gotta work for our dollars and answer yeah. questions. You don't got time to be making the phone calls to Cougar. Cougars can't even talk, so yeah. this is a waste of time. They don't even have thumbs. How are they gonna dial the phone? Yeah, they can't even press send. All right, those are some good questions, I guess. Yeah, those are not bad. I'm pretty glad to be yeah. back talking to you guys. Yeah, I know. But uh, actually, next time you should ask us some better questions, not like really strain for us to think of. <laughs> yeah, it's getting too easy for us. It's yeah. like we're coming up with this off the top of our heads. We just yeah. got done you know, studying science for you. Yeah, we we just went and studied science. That's why we've been gone for like a year. Yeah. And then all you give us is crap. <laughs> Thanks for all this crap. That's what we think of that crap. Yeah. So, I guess... Uh, that crap is crap. Yeah. So anyways, I guess we'll see you next time when you ask us stuff that's a little bit harder for us to know about, maybe. Yeah, but thank you for like taking your time and typing out all those questions for us. Yeah. I guess it wasn't a waste of time because you got your answer, but it might have wasted our time. <laughs> anyways, we probably should get back to like learning more knowledge to answer your questions. And building 
like stuff, all the bones. Yes, and like learning about eating nutrition. Yeah, and watching MacGyver. Yes. So, so we gotta get back to answering Anyways, the questions. Have a great day, jerk. <laughs> that was great. Oh, it just threw my back out on that one. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Oh! <laughs>